Hello, 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 mga beshi. In this video, I will share to you my sample MOV or mail certification for our RPMS 2023. Craft 5, objective number 13, which is based on the PPSC 7.1.2. Applied a personal philosophy of teaching that is learner-centered. Here is my reflection or journal on the same indicator. A learner-centered teaching philosophy is an approach to education that places the learner at the center of the learning process. It recognizes that each learner is unique and that has their own needs, interests, and abilities. The primary goal of the learner-centered approach is to facilitate the growth and development of learners by actively engaging them in the learning process and tailoring instructions to their individual needs. As an happy teacher, my learner-centered philosophy of from first to fourth quarter revolves around creating a supportive and engaging learning environment where students can develop strong literacy skills, effective involvement in class, and a lifelong love for the key components of the subject. Let's start with quarter one. My focus is on familiarization of the fundamental steps in dancing, wedding notes, and the elements of arts. I recognize that each student enters the classroom with different levels of proficiency. Some are good enough, but most of them need extra attention. So I employ differentiated instruction to meet their individual needs through a variety of activities such as guided discovery approach, modeling, and tutorials. I provided opportunities for students to develop their dance, music, and art skills. I also foster a love for music and dance by exposing students to a wide range and encouraging independent choreography through class practical tests and group tests. Moving on to quarter two, my learner-centered approach shifts toward developing students' in dancing skills. I guided them through the dancing process from the basic elements of dance choreography. I provide models and mentors to illustrate different uh, dances and genres. I encourage also students to express their creativity and voice in their dance. Through peer collaboration and feedback, students learn to reflect on their own and make improvements. Moving on to quarter three. My learner-centered philosophy focuses on developing effective use of technology. Essential not only in creating music students' background, editing video clips, but we feature in differ. This has been effective since most of our learners are equipped in the use of gadgets. I create opportunities for students to engage in meaningful discussions, presentations, and collaborative projects. Through small group activities, many collective activities, and role plays, students practice their skills in this part. I also integrate more. more Time media resources and technology tools to enhance their presentation skills and digital literacy. And finally, quarter four, I aim for foster and deeper. I aim to foster a deeper appreciation for dance, music, and arts to measure the creative output after the three quarters. So I selected each act age-appropriate dance genre, local music, and films that align with students' interests and address relevant things. Through exploration, I encourage them to make connections between the given theme and created their own experiences and perspective, and created their own experiences and perspective, fostering empathy and a deeper understanding of the subject or theme given. This has been effective since all students have met the requirement and achieved the competency. So, throughout the entire year, I embrace a learner-centered approach by incorporating student choice and voice in their learning process. I provide opportunities for the students to explore and discover their own skills that align with their interests and learning goals. I value their opinions and ideas 
encouraging active participation in class discussions and decision making. And by empowering students to take ownership of their learning, I foster intrinsic motivation and a sense of autonomy. So I hope this has been helpful to you, mga beishi. If you wish to have a copy of this, click the comment section below. Kung ito ay nakatulong sa inyo, please click like and subscribe. And also share this video if you haven't yet. See you next time, mga beishi. Bye!